Could Moff Gideon be Mandalorian? Hey everyone, this is Digital Charcuterie. If you're new to the channel, uh, you know, subscribe. We got a lot of videos coming. If you like the video, hit the like button. Let's get that out of the way. Let's move on. Moff Gideon, Mandalorian. Could this be? This guy's got this massive beef with Mandalore. He wants to like destroy it. Like just, just take it apart. And I understand he's evil and this is what bad guys do, but we're three seasons in. You think there might be some motive to this and why? And now he has Mandalorian armor and his best guard troopers and everything is Mandalorian inspired. The Praetorian guards are Mandalorian inspired. They look freaking amazing. Do not fight. I will not take no for an answer on that one. So could he be Mandalorian? Is it possible that he was a Mandalorian who was sent into exile for one reason or another? But he was smart, almost too smart, and he worked his way up the Imperial ranks and positioned himself to have some power and is the reason we have the Persian Mandalore. Maybe he it was his doing. He was a big part of that. And what he sees in Din Djarin in their Mandalorian is what could have been for Moff Gideon, but instead we have this, which like let's be honest, this is the coolest freaking outfit, right? Like this is like Darth Vader coolness here. We got the horns like from all freaking awesome armor or something. This is great. I love it. Is it possible that this is a scenario for Moff Gideon? What is he a Mandalorian, former Mandalorian, who was sent into exile for one reason or another. Maybe, maybe he was just lost on Tatooine because it's always Tatooine. He was just lost somewhere and they forgot to pick him up or whatever. It would be a possibility. It would add another level, another dynamic to Moff Gideon, something more to his character. This he's already such a great three-dimensional character. Giancarlo Esposito knocked it out of the park, obviously, with him. But this just adds so much more, and it makes his obsession with Mandalore and Din Djarin that much more intimate. That's just something that has been crossing my mind. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I really appreciate you guys sticking by. Please give us a like and a subscribe. But until next time, may the force of others be with you.